Shalom, shalom, shalom from the prayer mountain, the springs of life-giving water ministries, the dwelling place of El Shaddai, where tears are wiped from every eyes. El Shaddai bless and keep you. Thank you. Stay tuned and let us pray. Hallelujah. It is well with you all. Once again, you are welcome. On the twenty, on the seventh of November, twenty nineteen, seventh of November, twenty nineteen, even before anybody heard of the Corona virus, even before it was mentioned in the open. The Lord gave us this prophetic word and revelation. And I read it as we have it here on our Facebook page. Again, because we are in the midst of this right now. Read a lot, read a lot. Danger is hidden within this drug or drink. The danger is not explicit or originally revealed or people don't read the instructions. People are only made aware of this danger after they have taken the stuff. Or is the drug being tested on humans, hence the reason for hiding the danger in the original drug or stuff. May the Lord open our eyes to hidden truths that we fall not into temptation. Shalom, love from the springs of life-giving water ministries, the date 7th of 11 2019 hours this is a screenshot of that message that was sent out to more than 30 people more than 40 or 50 or 60 people on that particular day and from that time we started to pray as the lord led us before the coronavirus came out we started to pray that God will touch the heart of the drug companies. From November last year, 2019, that God will touch the heart of the drug companies, that they will not manufacture, they will not bring out any disease or sickness, that they will not bring out anything whatsoever that will warrant the production of drugs that can be tested on people, that no foreign or new sickness or strange sickness can be, shall be developed such that the drug companies will now come back to produce the um, drugs that will be used for the cure. That was our prayers from that November, as long as I can remember. And we kept watching to see what this is all about until the Corona virus saga erupted 
eventually, I think about the first week of December, that's one month after we've started praying concerning any strange disease, whatever be that, you know, that these drugs is being tested for. Whatever be that, whatever be the issue, we pray that God will touch the heart of the drug companies, that they consider human lives more than they consider profits. And when the corona issue started, we say, aha, that's what the Lord is saying. And we kept watching and things started to develop from eventual lockdown, travel bans, and everything that is going on, we continue to watch and pray. Children of the living God, everybody all over the world, let me tell you, it's only God himself that can save humanity from this very situation. And that's why we keep praying that whatever this is shall be dismantled in Jesus' name. Whatever this is, God reveals to deliver that it shall be dismantled in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We can see now these vaccines are being tested on humans. So it's something foreign, it's something unprecedented. And what we can tell you as far as this revelation or prophetic word from God is concerned is that there is danger hidden in that drug. There's danger hidden in the in that vaccine. Once again, whether the danger is intentionally planted there or as a human error. Whether the danger is hidden intentionally or the danger hid, hid himself there because human, human because of human error or because science is not God. So whether it's intentionally planted there whether this danger is intentionally planted in these vaccines we are talking about, may the Lord reveal and dismantle it in the name of Jesus Christ. Whether it is by human error or intentionally planted, may the Most High expose it, reveal it, dismantle it in the name of Jesus Christ. So that according to the wording of this revelation, which says here, or is the drug being tested on humans? Hence, the reason for hiding the danger in the original drug or stuff. Original or stuff. So let us pray, children of the living God, that while they are running clinical tests, testing these vaccines on humans, that God will intervene and anything that is dangerous, anything that is hidden in those vaccines that is dangerous to human life, that it shall be revealed before they roll out dangerous vaccines, let it be revealed, let it be exposed by the mercies of God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hence, the reason for hiding the danger in the original drug or stuff. I mourn for mankind. But when we pray, God answers. May the Lord open our eyes to hidden truths 
that we fall not into temptation in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I tell you this from the Lord who never lies and who never lied to us and who will never lie. There is danger hidden in those drugs, in those, in those vaccines. There is danger hidden in them. Tell everybody, let the government hear it. Let them reinvestigate. Let them search. Let them research again. There is danger. Whatever stockpile are here in America, they have millions of doses they have already stockpiled. You've already stockpiled millions of doses and you are testing it on humans. So assuming now they find out that those doses they, they produced, when did they produce it? When? Assuming that they find out there's something wrong, there's something hidden in it, there is something hidden in it either by error or by omission or by commission intentionally or by any means. They will now waste those millions of doses. Is that what they're going to tell us or what they're telling us? Children of God, we've got to pray. And God will dismantle whatever is hidden in those vaccines. And we shall pray for President Trump because they have cornered him into singing songs for the vaccines as the end point to this corona. They have cornered Donald Trump into singing praises for, the, for these vaccines. They've cornered the government into singing praises and elevating people's hopes to these vaccines. But we can tell them to research again and again and look deep into it. There is something wrong with it. Before we, before even every anybody come to know up here about Corona, we started to talk about this foreign, this strange sickness and the drugs that the drug companies will come out with. And they were already at the point we are talking with you now. They were already testing it on humans. By 11th, by the 7th of November, they were already testing the, the vaccines or whatever on humans or the coronavirus on humans. They've already injected it on humans or whatever they did and they are testing the treatment on humans. Whoever is responsible, whether it's China, whether China is collaborating with some people, the Lord will reveal and make it open in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. But what we are telling Donald, President Donald Trump, we have been praying for him from 2016 till now, is that he has been cornered into believing and into somehow connecting his reelection to the production of vaccines. He has to withdraw his steps and listen to this voice and we pray that this voice will get to his ears and to the ears of the well-meaning leaders in, uh, of this world and to the ears of the well-meaning scientists who are researching on this vaccine. Let them look again. Let them look again. If they can't look again, let God dismantle whatever is hidden or whatever is hidden or whatever danger that is hiding inside of the vaccines they have produced so that life will be saved. Read this red alert screenshot again and look at the date. Red alert, red alert. Danger is hidden within this drug or drink. The danger is not explicit or originally revealed. Praise the Lord. The Lord will reveal it. The Lord will expose it in the mighty name of Yeshua. Or people don't read the instructions. 
People are only made aware of this danger after they have taken the stuff. May God have mercy that people will not take this, this, these drugs, these vaccines, and then people, and then the world will experience some kind of catastrophe they have not experienced before. Maybe irreversible catastrophe. People are only made aware of this danger after they have taken this stuff. Or is the drug being tested on, hum on, on humans? Hence, the reason for hiding the danger in the original drug or stuff. And this suggests to me that there are hands deliberately working out this wickedness, as I may call it. And others are innocently following. But the Most High who rules in the affairs of man shall dismantle it as we pray in Jesus' name. May the Lord open our eyes to hidden truths that we fall not into temptation. In the mighty name of Yeshua. Love from the springs of life giving water ministries, the dwelling place of El Shaddai, where tears are wiped from every eyes. Please share this message with your friends and families. Share it with any group. Let this get to the to the to whoever shall be able to take action and look again into these verses. And we pray. President Donald Trump we stand up to this and ask what is the danger in the vaccines? They should find it out. They should find it out in the name of Jesus Christ. And God will hear our cry and our prayer. He is one who reveals to deliver. If somebody said to you there is a trap on that corner, don't walk by the right side, walk by the left side. If you trust that person, you will pass by the left side. And when you pass by the left side, anybody, any other person that passes by the right side will be caught up. We, we, we step into the trap and you who had passed by the left side will go and be thankful to the person who revealed the trap to you? Who told you, don't walk by the right side, walk by the left side? The Lord reveals to deliver. El Shaddai bless you and keep you, everybody out there. It is well with us. We shall live and not die in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Praising the Lord always. Praising.